So, we've got a pan with two kilos of water, with two kilos of sugar dissolved in it. We have to let that cool, and then we add that to a apple mix that we've already got in the fermenting barrel. Stay tuned. We may get cider at the end of it. May. Possibly. Could be. Maybe. Yeah, well, we'll wing it. So, just open my fermenting bucket to add the next section. Smells amazing. And we got bubbles. Natural yeast. That's why I've had to let that cool all night. Because if I add it warm, it kills the natural yeast. So, let's add it. So we're just above 15 litres. It's cold the last section will be added later because I've got to do it again, which is sugar water, or I might do a jar of honey instead. What about a jar of honey? That's more easier. It's not easy, it's healthier. Yeah. Because suddenly it's two kilos of sugar. Healthy. We want healthy. Yep. Yeah. Right, so it looks like I'm buying a jar of honey. I'm and then, I don't know whether I'm going to leave it to it for a week or just yeah, add some yeast. Either way, we're over halfway there. And we've got another fermenting bucket, so I think we're going to be on. Plus, we've got a poorly child today. Making the next batch, and the next batch I'm adding sim cinnamon sticks to. So it's going to be apple cinnamon and cinnamon. Sticks. Yes, apple and cinnamon alcohol. Oh, that sounds nice. Look. So, stay tuned. So, we've just got here this morning. I've got Jade with me today because she's poorly. I've just fed the lambs and the meat chicks. And we've got a meat chick down. It's collapsed. It's actually quite common in the farms. Obviously, we're not on a farm. But I've got here this morning. There's one on its side. Perfectly healthy, perfectly happy. Still eating, drinking. Not like the other one we lost. But... Oh, He's down, his hip's gone. It's water, you two. And there's a couple of them getting like it. So, I will show you. There we go. Different. I'll show you the meat chicks, but we've got one completely down and a few are going wobbly. Unfortunately, it happens. I'll show you, he'll be sorted today. We'll process him early. But it's perfectly fine. It's just his hips have collapsed. So, you can see the size of them. No injury. But, uh, I'll show you. Completely, left leg, hips gone. So, we'll leave him in the pen for now so he can fill himself up. Meat chick down! Hip collapsed! He's not the only one, there's a few of these showing symptoms. All the joys are really meat birds. So, we've been planning for the Earthship for weeks. So, as you can see. But the chainsaw broke. Well, it ran out of fuel. So we've been using two bow saws, me and Mandy. And then we'll use the chainsaw when we can be bothered. To, well, not bothered, but when we can go and fetch some petrol. And I mix it. But we've got them to do. Because that's my peg over there. And that's 30 foot. Because it was going to be 12 by 15 and it just didn't look big enough. So we went bigger. So we're going 20 foot by 30 foot. 20 foot wide, 30 foot long. And that's 30 foot from here. So there's 30 to there. There's 20 that way. 30 that way and 20 this way. So, stay tuned. We've already dragged half on it up there. So, we will get there. It's nice having been quiet, no kids. As you can see, they have dumped half a sack of food all over the floor so they're not being fed. One of my dark hair glazes is all puffed up, but that's because she's in mass molt, so she's dropping all her feathers. And she's not the only one. We've got a lot of them molting now. So I will leave you with these for half an hour. Well, about five, ten minutes while we go and fetch some water for the babies. And then I'll move you on to the next pen. It can look so good. But we 
they've got another brooding. It kind of looks like a frizzle. She looks like a frizzle at me. She's going to fall out. She's going to fall out. She's going to The musky babies won't come out. And silver. And silver. Can you see that one there? Yeah. Go for it, Jade. That's the new boy. Go on, you can do it. We've just had silver and one of the babies loose. So we can get some close-ups. 
Right, come on, dig the hole deeper so the fence will drop in. We've got more to do. Let's see if we can get some slow mows. I have to watch this because it looks like the Bahamas got hiccups. Hi, doll. That's my phone. Hey. We've dug out the gateways to drop the gateways a bit more. But they seem to have hiccups. Never seen it before.
We've got a broody as well. <sighs> and she's overtaken the nest. <sighs> she's been trying to go broody all year. Shed needs cleaning. It's only been a week. She's a beautiful girl, so I'm going to let her. Marco eggs. You can't go in that pen. She'll have you. Bluebell wants to have an egg. I might put a cover over up front to uh, get them to lay in that S box. Worth a try. Try and bring the doves back. Try. Try as we might. Come on, kids. Yeah, they've gone that way. Don't ask me where they've gone now.